everyone, it's Gail. I am here with some items that I am listing on my Etsy shop. I am going to upload this video and as soon as it's uploaded, these I will publish these listings. And my Etsy shop is Cinnamon Tea. And I'll put the link in the description box, of course. So a few different things this time. Um, first of all, I am restocking the fabric flips. Not everyone has gotten them that's wanted them. So with that item, you get a full page fabric flip and a small fabric flip. And then of course I send you one more just for good measure and as a thank you. So I have 16, I have 16 of those ready to go. Um, I'll just, as the orders come in, I just kind of take them from the top. If you do order more than one flip, I will um, make sure that I have different ones for you. So, you know, one of these and then one of a total different design. So fabric flips are going in. Um, these, I, I got a really wonderful bundle or uh, bolt, I guess you would say, of these trims and laces. So thought I would share them more than I could use. So um, these are going on. And this particular one here is... The one that the famous one that I used on my on my uh, my spine of my ephemera journal, which of course that didn't go quite as planned. But hey, it's tough. It's it's an awesome awesome spine. So I have five of those. There is a yard of each of these trims, and I've um, pinned them so uh, with cute pins. So that's kind of just a little added something. So there's those. Then there's this little fabric bundle. It's, um, they're all coordinating fabrics in mint green. And um, there's quite a lot here. I would say there's between a half and a quarter of a yard of each of them. Maybe a little less, maybe a little more of one or the other. So that is going on just as a fabric bundle, all of them together. So that'll be fun. And then, um, and then I have a couple of vintage finds that I'm adding in. This is the Good Housekeeping Cookbook. This one's uh, copyright is 1963. And so, of course, it's got some of the cool illustrations from, from back in the day. And, you know, chock full of recipes. I think this book with the index has like eight, yeah, over 800 pages. So it's a big old book, um, would make a really fun journal, um, or a really great cookbook, one or the other. <laughs> so that is on there. And then this one, I had no idea until I started to re research a bit. Apparently this is quite the find. This one's, um, copyright is 1944. It's again, the Good Housekeeping Cookbook. And, um, these were in in absolutely falling apart condition, they were $50. So apparently this one's kind of sought after. But anyway, I did I did a better price than that. But what I wanted to show you with this one is the cover is coming off. I thought about repairing it, but then I thought, you know, for us and journals and whatever, we may not want to, but really all one needs to do is glue that and it'll be it'll be fine again. But of course, it's got it's got wonderful pictures in it as well, and it's just apparently just quite the uh, quite the coveted vintage find. So um, so anyway, I'm putting that on. Those two cookbooks are going to go on. Then um, I I have been kind of trying to filter out some things, and so I went through my inventory of things that were I had when I was doing craft sales and when I had my work in um, an art gallery. And so anyway, so this is, this is from my craft sale days. This is a tool belt apron. The dimensions and stuff are on my, um, are on the description, but it's got three little pockets here. And what I, I used mine for craft sales and I'd have my phone in one, cash in one, receipt book in another, that sort of thing. Or 
um, the one that I have, I wear around the house sometimes just so I can have my phone in the pocket when I'm cleaning or running around the house um, and don't have pockets in whatever I'm wearing. So, so yeah, so they come in handy and it's just, it's just a sweet little apron. So I put that on and then these were um, at the art gallery and these are uh, stationary packs. So it's my original artwork and um, these are jelly prints that I collaged on here and um, and uh, this one, this one, and this one. I have them named on my Etsy as butterfly, pink flower, bird, and Paris. And there's six pieces in here. It's just, it's on copy paper, not um, photo paper. And so I thought I'll put these on, you know, um, maybe folks would want to use them either in a journal as pages or they could also just be used for collage. So there's those. I'm listing those. And then last but never ever least, I have three bunny kits um, that are coming on. I did the farm kits and everybody loved those. So I am, I just did a bunny one and I have had so many bunny things sent to me and you guys, you guys are so generous and, and then collected my own bunny stuff too. And so I'm like, I'm like just being driven out of my craft room with all the bunny stuff. So I'm going to try and get these out of here and show you what is in this little kit. Okay, I might lose I, I might lose a bunny along the way. Okay, so let's let's kind of start here. So I'm not going to take these apart, but this little pack has some appliques. It's got um, it's got uh, some bunny cards in it. Uh, it's got bunny buttons of different kinds. There's plastic. There's wooden. It's got some. Um, wooden um what do you call these pieces little like chipboard pieces but they're wooden so that's what's in here um over here that fell off we've got a couple of bunny things just little little bunny cards these are i don't know they're front and back they're like a little almost like a little ornament or something but they'd be super cute and you could this one this one you could actually use it that way or cut it in part and have two there's a wooden bunny with um, some wonderful gingham on him. There's a group of a bunch of um, cupcake, bunny cupcakes. This little bag has uh, appliques, or actually these are all stickers. These are all bunny stickers. And then I put a couple of um, journaling cards in each one as well. So that's what's in that little sack. Okay, and then, um, let's see where to start. Uh, there are, there are bits and pieces of, um, scrapbooking paper. There are also three 12 by 12 sheets of scrapbooking paper in there. Um, there are napkins. There's just this whole, uh, whole thing of napkins. Let me show you. Um, so there's Kleenexes with bunnies, super cute. There's this one, this one, this one, and this one. As far as napkin, bunny napkins. I specifically really didn't want this to, this kit to go on around Easter because in my opinion, every season is bunny season. It's not, it's definitely not just for Easter. Okay, so there's that. Then there's this cute little stamp that I got those in Happy Mail and I got enough to share as well. Let's see. Oh, here's some more napkins. Here's some more napkins. I didn't, I probably put those in afterwards and didn't, um, didn't get them in the, into the sack. I can put those in, but that little bunny and some carrots that little bunny and this guy. And um, 
like I think most of those those uh, napkins are the same in every one, but there could be variations, you know, depending on what I had available. So there's some bunny fabric, lots of fabric. This is a fat quarter, um, just to show you all the different the different bunny patterns. And this was great because I was able to share with you guys and still had enough enough for me so that was nice and all this kind of this came from um wonderful uh wonderful subbies so okay so there's the fabric then what is this this is just another uh another piece of scrapbooking paper um a couple of cards here with bunnies uh let's see we have bunny more bunny paper and bunny stationery with a bunny envelope. <laughs> so that's in there. Um, uh, part of a paper pad with bunnies. Let's see, let's get that back with the fabric. And then some book pages, bunny book pages, bunnies, 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 lots of children's book pages with bunnies on them all different sorts and styles. Um, look at those, aren't they cute? Oh my gosh, I love bunnies. <laughs> and, and then this one, I think there's just the one. And this one, bunnies and bunnies. And then um, I think these are uh, Beatrice Potter. And then I told you the three pages of scrapbooking paper, which I'll show you these. This one, this one, and this one. And and then each um, each kit also has a little golden book. So let's see. There's the scare bunny. There's little cottontail, and there's the bunny book. So that's how they'll be designated. Um, on the listing so that pretty well does it with what's going to be listed and as I said I will upload this video and as soon as it uploads um, I will just hit the publish button so as soon as you see this if there's something you're interested in pop on over quickly and um, and hopefully it'll hopefully it'll still be there for you so there we go. Thank you, everyone. I really appreciate so very much, of course, your support of my YouTube channel, but also your amazing support of my Etsy shop. It, you know, it just allows me to make, um, make enough that I can keep doing what I love doing. And I'm so very grateful. So thanks, everybody. We'll just see you in the next video. Bye-bye.